Welcome to the Hot Mic SE. The EFF strategic offer to the ANC sparked social media speculations. The EFF's offer to work with the ANC in a new government formation ignited speculation about the party's true intentions. The Red Berets said they would work with the ANC if it aborts the government of national unity and political parties that represent the white supremacist agenda. The party also advised the ANC to address the problems faced by the country's largest ethnic group as encapsulated in the Freedom Charter. Social media speculations was right about the reasons behind the economic freedom fighters' offers to join the African National Congress and form a new government that excluded the Democratic Alliance and the FF+. Some netizens thought the party was desperate to join the government of national unity, while others believed the EFF stance was to reveal that the ANC's leadership was committed to working with the Democratic Alliance. The at EFF South Africa sent a letter to the ANT after the two parties met to discuss the government of national unity and the yet to be finalized seventh administration in Johannesburg on 8 June 2024. The party said the statement was to state its position to avoid any misinterpretation. Some of the conditions listed by the Secretary General Marshal Dlamini was that the EFF was open to working with the ANT if it abandoned the government of national unity and the political parties that the Red Berets deemed to represent what it labeled a white supremacist agenda. Dlamini added that the agreement should address the problems faced by the country's largest ethnic group as encapsulated in the Freedom Charter. We conclusively advise that the ANC must not work or co-govern with the DA and FF Plus in the interest of its historic mission. This, the ANT must do, even if it believes that the EFF is not its preferred partner. Social media was ablaze with opinions and conspiracy theories on the EFF's bold statement. Some comments read, The EFF is smart. They offer themselves knowing very well that the ANC is going to reject them. They just want to expose the ANC to its constituency by unwittingly saying, You see, the ANC loves DA even if it is unnecessary. Another comment read, the ANC is desperate to have the DA in the Grand Coalition. The purported statement is just gallery politicking to hunt weak the unsuspectingly voters. It's a done deal. Another comment read, Though I'm not the EFF fan, but this can be the best way to move forward as a country and let the DA and VF do what they do best, opposition. Another comment read, The EFF is led by intellects. ANT WhatsApp groups are so happy with this deal. No reasonable and sound person can reject this. Should the ANC reject this, their members will believe what we have been telling them about the ANC. Thank you all for watching and please don't forget to kindly drop your comment, drop a like and please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. Thank you.